Thursday, May 26th, 2016. Just woke up, going to get a haircut. Trying to get the day started off right. I haven't had any coffee yet though, so you know how that can be for me, guys. Not good. I just got my hair cut. It is like 95 degrees outside right now in New Jersey. Insane. But I just got my hair cut, trimmed it up. Feels so much better. I feel like an adult now. It's a great feeling. <laughs> just got home. I've realized that when I cut my hair short, especially in the back and the sides, it just feels so much cleaner. I just feel neater when I have it like this, which is a really nice feeling. RIP to the flow, RIP to the lettuce. Memories were good. It'll always come back though. So this website really isn't working, but we're planning our road trip right now. So it looks like we're gonna start up here in New Jersey, go all the way to the Grand Canyon, Yosemite, hit Seattle, and then we're gonna come back a northern route up here through Montana, Idaho, all the way back down into Jersey. And it's gonna be, and it's gonna be insane. Is that too much, Josh? You think we can do it? Can we crush it? Easily. We wrote a whole schedule out. It looks like it's gonna take us like two and a half weeks. If you live along the route, let us stay with you. Yeah, that'd be cool. If someone has a house with like eight bedrooms in it, that'd be sweet if you want to let us stay with you. I'm pretty excited for this trip. It's just gonna be the longest drive I'll ever do in probably my entire life. I mean, it couldn't, I couldn't do a longer drive if I tried. We're going around the entire country. So it'll be pretty intense, uh, but it'll be a blast. We're gonna see a lot of things that we've never seen before. So, I'm taking this wagon. Me? <laughs> <laughs> this Jeep has already made it to Montana and back with us in it. And this year it's gonna make it around the entire country. So whoever gets this car next is gonna be a lucky person. Dude. Who wants it? If you want my Jeep, I'll probably give it to you after our road trip or something. I don't want it anymore. Uh, it lost focus. This camera cannot focus, man. It's focusing on me, man, because I'm the highlight and the sun is shining on me. You're right. Focus on me. Nope. It's bad that you cut your hair. So at some point today I got a splitting headache. So I decided to kind of change up the, the format of my regular vlog and do a Q&A with you guys. I got B-dubs to go, and usually Wings, you know, Buffalo Wild Wings cures most of my problems in life. So that's gonna help while I do this. So if I'm eating obnoxiously, excuse me, I'll try to be polite. Not really. Let's get started with this. Some of these questions are kind of weird. Brianne Kelly asks, why does Chomik hate Ryan? I think really if you just watch one of Ryan's videos, you'd understand that. But also if you watch one of Chomik's videos, you'd understand why Ryan hates Chomik. So it's kind of a straightforward answer, I think. Your girl Christina asks, what's your best memories with SDK? One of my favorite memories with SDK, and we all agree this is one of our favorite memories, is when we first started the first night, we announced the name of the channel, we had a barbecue at Adam and Nick's and swam, and it was just a, such a fun night. It was such a good time. Glamorama asks, do you regret anything you did in high school? Not really. Uh, I regret not playing sports. It's not, I don't really regret it, but I wish I had pushed myself to play sports. I ended up making videos instead, so I guess it kind of worked out. But I was going to try out for baseball, because I love baseball. I love playing it. I decided against it like the night before tryouts freshman year. <laughs> Maria CSWS asks, Would you rather eat 10 bees in order to save Ryan Ape, or would you just let him die? I'd eat the bees. I, I mean, Ryan's all right. You know, he has things to offer the world, I guess. I get a lot of disturbing questions, but this is probably the most disturbing. Raising underscore hope zero zero asks, do you wear socks when you sleep? Of course not. Why would I do that? Okay, that's just, I don't even want to get into that one. Lucy underscore Hodges says, tips for new vloggers. I would say consistency from what I'm learning. I've only been doing this for two months now. Consistency is really important. And... Learning that even on days when you don't want to do it, because there are days I'm a human where I'm like, man, I just want to lay in bed or I don't want to talk to a camera. And I always push through that. And by the end of the day when I'm editing, I'm like, wow, I'm so glad I decided to film today because it was awesome. So pushing yourself and really being consistent is super important, I think. Anna 
at ZXRROLD asks, when you eat a taco, do you tilt your head or the taco? Usually it's like one of these. It's like, a, yeah, I tilt my head, I guess, to make sure I don't spill the stuff. Good question. That's a very interesting thought. Thug Pizza asks, what's your favorite or least favorite movies? Okay, this is a great question. I love this question. My favorite movie ever is It's a Wonderful Life. The Christmas movie. I love that movie more than any movie ever. It is when I I don't only, I only watch it at Christmas time, but I just love I love to watch it. It makes me so happy. Um, I think it's like a great story and it's just a happy story in my opinion. Uh, least favorite movie I've ever seen. Oh, let me think about this one. I remember when I went to the movies and I saw Green Lantern in the theater. I remember leaving thinking that was terrible. I did not enjoy that at all. And I never think that I'm not like a critical movie person. If I'll just enjoy, I'll watch a movie and enjoy it. I did not enjoy that movie in the theater, but I have to watch it again really now because one of my friends probably made me watch it in IMAX and I hate 3D, but I always go and I always regret it. Another time when this happened is when I went to see Up, the Disney movie in theaters. My friends were like, dude, like, let's go see Up in 3D and I'm like, ah, oh, I don't want to see it in 3D, let's just see it regular. I love Disney movies. I'll go, see, I'll go see any Disney movie, just not 3D. I like to see it regular. I go to see Up. And the whole movie, I, I'm hating the 3D. Everything's foggy and it's hard to see. And then five minutes before the movie ends, I look at my friend and I'm like, dude, I was like, my glasses are terrible. And we switch and I take his glasses and I realize that my glasses were broken the entire movie and I just didn't even realize. So I felt really stupid. But I'm gonna end it here. Thank you guys for the questions and thank you for watching this vlog. I will see you all tom tomorrow. It's gonna be Saturday. So I will see you guys on Monday. This is going to be an awesome weekend. I hope you all have a great Memorial Day weekend and spend some time with your friends and family, all you Americans. And yes, peace.